Mr. Speaker. Order, questions for oral answer. Mr. Sean Huang. Question one. Mr. Speaker, Mandai Wildlife Group will move more than 3,000 birds and about 50 species of flora from Jurong Bird Park to Bird Paradise at Mandai after Jurong Bird Park closes on 3rd January 2023. Mandai Wildlife Group's detailed planning for this move includes necessary steps and measures to ensure the welfare health and safety of the birds during the relocation. The Jurong Bird Park site is expected to be turned to JTC in 2025. JTC is working with Mandai Wildlife Group and relevant agencies on the reinstatement of the site after Jurong Bird Park moves to Mandai. Mr. Sean Huang. Mr. Speaker, I thank the MOS for his answer. Mr. Speaker, being in Singapore, we have constantly evaluated the balance of development Dover Forest was 33 hectares, Drongberg Park is 20. This green space is substantial. As such, I have three supplementary questions. First, what is the determined annual economic potential of the land of Drongberg Park? You can just keep Park? the two questions, select the two. Yes. They could be derived from its development. And two, would there be a cross-ministry work group that would coordinate and determine this balanced approach of redeveloping lush green spaces? Thank you. Thank the member for his questions. We don't have the economic value of the site. I'll get back to the member. But uh, JTC and URA are jointly reviewing the longer-term land use plans for the site along with other agencies like NPARCs. And we will take into consideration existing features such as the waterfall as well as Jurong Hill Tower nearby. And we understand and given the memories and history tied to Jurong Bird Park, we will seek public feedback in due time to shape the future plans for Jurong Hill together. Uh, meanwhile, I encourage uh, everyone to visit Jerome Bird Park before it closes on 3rd of January 2023 uh, and also to support uh, our bird paradise when it opens in the second quarter of 2023. Thank you.